Check this out, guys. Super rare find for me. Well, not necessarily a rare find, a rare catch. Um, this is a northern alligator lizard. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I found her underneath this rock. She must be hibernating. Oh, dude, this is so awesome. I find these pretty often in the summertime if I'm looking for them. Oh, don't, don't get away. Um, hold on a sec. There we go. So, ah, oh, come on. I don't know how to hold a lizard. I know how to hold salamanders and frogs, but lizards, I'm, I'm clueless. Um, so I find these pretty guy, these guys pretty often in the summertime, but I never could actually catch them because they're so fast. Um, so this is a pretty awesome find for me. I don't find these guys very much. Uh, you see it actually regrowing its tail there. You can see that. Beautiful pattern, though. I'd love to take some pictures of her, but I don't know if she'll hold still. Yeah, just found her underneath this rock. Must be hibernating or something. That's really cool. Oh, don't freak out on me. Awesome. Okay, guys, so I found another one to my shock. So this one's a little bit bigger. I found them under a rock as well. Um, this is awesome. I have not found or handled lizards like this in a very long time. If really, oh, dude, this one's big. Holy smokes. That's a pretty big guy. Um, very beautiful. I mean, look at those white spots. Those spots are really cool, I think. Those white spots on them, you can see. Uh, this guy's got his full tail, though. Awesome. Just found this guy under a rock. This rock right here. That rock. Um, that's very, very cool. I've never handled these guys, really. I find them up here in the summer all the time, but most of the time how I spot them is by hearing them run away. I never, I can never catch them. Um, they're always too quick. It's because of the tall grass and stuff, but, you know, they can just hide. I'll never see them. Um, and if I do, it's just hard to catch them. So uh, these guys are pretty slow right now, I think, because, you know, it's like 50 degrees and rainy. So um, I'm really surprised I'm finding these guys. This is like one of the first times I've ever been able to find reptiles by just rock flipping. Um, for some reason I've never had luck with that before, but then again I haven't, in the winter time, or in the spring, I haven't really done a whole lot of this. Uh, but definitely very excited to find these guys. Beautiful, beautiful lizards. Northern alligator lizards. I couldn't grab any pictures of the last one, so I'll see if I can... Nah, you know what? I'll just let her go. I'll just let her be. Video is good enough. Check this out. I just spotted this rough skanoot. Just walking on the grass right there. Dude, this is my lucky day, man. That is crazy. I have never just spotted them walking through the woods or anything like that before. I only find them on the road. So, to find this one just on accident is extremely lucky. This is a female. Oh my goodness. That's two alligator lizards and a rough skin newt in a matter of like, I don't know, 10 minutes. Take a look at her belly. See her nice belly there. Just a small little female. That's beautiful. Uh, awesome. Well, I am glad I came up here. I've never had this kind of success before. Not on this hill. So, grab some pictures of her and let her go. 
and uh, let's keep this good look going. Beautiful. Okay guys, alligator lizard number three. I am just trying to escape. Hold on here a second. Don't, don't try to run away on me, please. So, another beautiful alligator lizard. Man, I have been missing out all these years. I had no idea you could be so successful, or I could be so successful this time of year. Oh, come on, I don't want to grab your tail. I don't want you losing your tail on me or anything. How am I supposed to hold lizards? Okay, I honestly, I'm sorry I'm such a noob at this, but I just don't handle lizards like ever, so. They're different than salamanders because they move around so much and they're stronger and stuff. Beauty. This is a big one too. I mean, look at the size of this thing. I mean, this is one of the biggest alligator lizards I've ever found. I mean, that's not really saying much because I haven't ever actually caught these guys very much, so I honestly don't even know how big they get. But, big long tail. Big fat. Oh man, it's my day today. Go ahead and put her back. I also found um, I found two redback salamanders, but I haven't filmed them. Today, today is my lucky day. Literally, the next rock after the one after after finding that alligator lizard you just saw, I found this one. It's just a little juvenile. Oh, that's a good shot. These guys are beautiful. Just curled up underneath the rock. Nice juvenile patterning. Oh, that light brown is so cool. I love that. Just found them underneath this. This is a pretty small rock, too. Oh, yeah, there he goes. I'll let him go. He <laughs> popped out of my hand. Uh, but wow, I mean, that's four in like, what, half hour? Plus a rough skin and two redback salamanders. Man, today has turned out to be a great day for herping. So let's go find some more. I'm, I'm excited now. Look what I found. <laughs> He's hiding underneath that little piece of wood. That's the tail of an alligator lizard. Let's see if I can get this guy out of here. Come on now. Let's not be shy. There he is. Whoa, he's bigger than I thought. I don't think something that big could fit in there. Ugh. Okay, I don't want to lose him. Oh, he's got a little hole. Come here, you. Awesome. Dude, that's number five. This is just crazy. Look at that beautiful lizard. Northern alligator lizard, nice, nice long tail. Oh. I'll just let him go. Oh my gosh, that's just so cool. Just look at all these nice rocks down here and stuff. Great habitat.